so many times these days, I think we just fall into this trap like a, when there's no storm, there's no need for us to pray. When there's no storm, there's no need for us to, to read the scripture. Uh, it is kind of a human nature. When we, when, we, when we run into problem, that is when we know God. See, when you run into a problem, oh, that's when I started having a relationship with Christ. And I said, you want to start developing a relationship with Christ. Now, when you run into God, you see, you cannot really uh, have successfully uh, overcome this storm when you have no relationship. You don't pray. You don't read the word of God. I mean, it becomes so hard for you to overcome or to reign over the storm. People like that can easily go down with the storm. Uh, but God has not called us. That is the assurance. God has not called us to go down with the storm, but to rise above the storm. So we need to develop an active praying, active prayer life. So because uh, during the camp season right now, this is the this is the time whether we, we need to constantly pray, constantly spend our time, you know, in prayer, in fellowship with Christ. Because in a way, you are preparing for this time. Because when this time comes, you already developed the, the, the you already cultivated the habit of praying. So it is not a big deal when it comes. When this time comes, you just dive into it. In fact, you, you jump in, you dive even more than before. See, because uh, you've cultivated that habit already. So we need to grow in our prayer life. And learn to turn to God. Because most of the time, we need to learn to turn to God in this, in this calm season. Like when the little thing happens, you, you, you're going to, you, you, you are talking to God about it straight away. So you don't talk to people about those stuff. You talk to God straight away because every single time you've developed that relationship with Christ. When anything happens, you talk to God about it. You see, because so many times human beings, we, we, say, we react to things by instinct. You see, we think, okay, you make something happen, the very first thing, like, what can I do to help myself? You see, we forget about God. We forget about what what does the what does the word of God say about my situation? Man, I need to pray about this stuff. I need to talk to God about this. Or sometimes we might in the midst of making a decision, maybe to do something. But we tend to ask people, what do you think about that? But we forget about I need to ask God first. You see, in this calm season, this is always the best time when those things happen. Every decision, little decision that we think we can easily make ourselves. Why don't you just tell God about this decision? Let's ask the Holy Spirit, what do you think about this? How can I go about this stuff? You see that? We are cultivating that habit. We are developing ourselves in this calm season. Then when this, when this time comes, guess what? You are able to stand. So the prayer becomes easy for you. So you can't run to God when the things are very tough. Quick, You can easily run to God, but uh, sometimes you might probably just don't even know what to say. You don't even know how to start because you haven't got used to that before. So when you have already developed that relationship, you can easily talk to the Father. Father, this is what I'm going through right now. What should I do? 